I'll admit, I have a small obsession with pumpkins. They just instantly give you that warm, fuzzy fall feeling, right? These pumpkins are foam and they're 40% off, which makes this project even more affordable. Here's our inspiration. Just one of these pumpkin topiaries is 250 bucks and that doesn't even include the planter urn. For two topiaries, you'll need six pumpkins, two small, two medium, and two large. Also two hefty wood dowels. These are a half inch thick. A box cutter, a power drill, and some drill bits to drill through the foam. Plus your planters filled with dirt or rocks to keep them stable. I was going to paint these to look like the inspiration pick, but look how cute they already are. These are from Hobby Lobby, so I'm just going to leave them as is. There are a bunch of pumpkins and other color options at Hobby Lobby, so you can really make this custom to how you want it. This is the top of the pumpkin, so we're going to leave that cute little stem on these. But these, the cute stems have to go so that they can stack on top of each other. Oh, oh, that's fun. That's easier than I expected. <laughs> Careful with the box cutter, you may want to wear gloves. This part of the project is not for the kids. Then just pull the stems out. That is just, that's just brute strength. Some were harder than others. These already have a core drilled through the middle as well, so I just had to drill through the bottom to skewer them. So you want it to go all the way through so that it can stick into the planter. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Okay. Uh oh, that one went through. Okay, we're gonna have to glue that back. <laughs> My wood dowels were just a smidge too long and it made the top stem come off, but I was easily able to just hot glue it back on after cutting down the dowel. No, can you believe the Sawzall didn't cut it? So, take two. Gosh, that was so much easier. I later added some fake fall leaves at the base from Dollar Tree. So the total cost for two topiaries, under 85 bucks. 